I'm glad you're here. I'll leave you with him. Anything for my favorite freelancer. Everyone ready to go? I know I am. Yeah, so we got a problem. When you say problem, you don't mean... We need to talk. Well, that's ominous. The Dominion forces are converging on the Heart of Rage. The Monitor is making his move, even if it costs him an entire army. You're out of time. I need a solution. I got the seals ready, but they don't work. Explain. Everything is a spec, but they don't activate, and hell if I know why. Something's missing from the design. There is no time for this. I am two seconds away from sending every Sentinel in the fort after the Monitor. You can't send them. You know what happened to the Freelancers, it'll be a bloodbath. Their sacrifice could save everyone else. We are all dead if the Monitor succeeds in weaponizing the Cenotaph. Their deaths won't stop the Monitor, you know that. Too many lives are at stake for me to do nothing and just hope that the three of you get your shit together. I just hold them back a little longer. I'll get the seas to work if it kills me. You'd better. They can race the Monitor through the storm and wind, but the Sentinels will still fail. They have no training with Shaper Relics, no knowledge of the Cenotaph. We do. We spent years on this. We're the only ones that can end this cataclysm and you know it. Give us time. Look, you two called me for help. I could have left you at Princess Zim's court. Don't make me regret that. Now, the lives of everyone in the fort and all of Antium are hanging by a thread. You have until the transport striders arrive. Get it done. What is she talking about?
Hey, Zoe. Keeping busy? You're not the only one that keeps me on my toes. Just your favorite. Of course. What's on the docket? Basic repairs? Always. Plus, I'm refurbishing the inner lining of Wright's Javelin. And Sentinel Hayden's getting extra lumber support whether he likes it or not. It's an easy ad. Small comforts make a big difference. People underestimate that. Those comforts make life better out there, even if you don't notice it every day. I like to think that matters. Especially since my son told me he's going to be a freelancer. How old is he? Eleven. He'll want to be a dozen things before I have to worry. But I still worry. There are risks, sure. But there's nothing like being out there helping people, seeing the world. Flying. It's not the worst dream for a kid to have. You're not wrong. The world's chaos. If he can dream about good things that could come out of it, why not let him? Tomorrow we'll want to be a Korox teamer anyway. Besides, if he becomes a freelancer, you'll have his suit in top shape. That should give you some peace of mind. Not sure that works when you're the pilot's mother. It barely works with the rest of you. Because we're your favorites? Always. <laughs>